Hello, colors. Welcome back to Viva Barca. Welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with Jao Felix as Xavi does not see the 50 million rated Portuguese forward as a priority target for Barcelona. We are going to discuss on that as we progress. Secondly, talking about Bernardo Silva as Barca coach Xavi still continue to get in touch with a Manchester City player over a possible move to Camp Nou as Dembele's move to PSG a possibility. We are also going to be looking at that. So guys, as we get right into it in much detail, please do ensure to subscribe if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. Usman Dembele's potential move to Paris Saint-Germain has forced Barcelona to step up their efforts to sign a new forward. The club have been recently linked with a move for Jao Felix, who had expressed his desire to sign Barcelona earlier in the summer. Another option for Barca is Bernardo Silva. The club could be in a position to go after the Portuguese international if they receive big money for Dembele this summer. So, according to Javi Miguel, Felix is not a priority for Xavi Hernandez. The Barcelona coach is well aware of his options in the market, but he does not want to prioritize a move for the Atletico Madrid forward. This comes on the back of several reports that suggested Barcelona are in conversation with Atletico Madrid seeking a loan deal for the Portuguese international. However, signing Felix, whose current market value stands at 50 million euros, could be a costly affair, even on a loan deal. Xavi therefore has yet to show any urgency in signing the former Benfica man. Barca, though, have rekindled the pursuit of Felix following speculations linking Dembele to a move to PSG. But whether or not they will go through with the deal remains to be seen. However, Bernardo Silva remains a target. On the flip side, Javi Miguel claims that Barca have a minimum chance of signing Bernardo Silva following the exit of Usman Dembele. It is no secret that Xavi is a huge admirer of the Manchester City superstar. The Barca coach sees him as an ideal man to reinforce the team's ranks in the interior midfield position. But between João Felix and Bernardo Silva, the latter, or the former, appears to be more financially viable option for Barca. It is therefore up to Barca to make a decision as they look to reinforce their options in the attacking unit. Of course, Dembele's links to Barca have generated a lot of other transfer news linking to you know, the sale of Dembele. Because Dembele leaving, there's a lot of things that can happen. There's a lot of tweaks, a lot of changes that could happen. Of course, we have been talking about Jao Felix, not today, but some weeks ago, when the player had that interview with Fabrizio Romano claiming how he wants to join Barca one day. It is a dream since he was a kid playing for the red and blue, you know, for the prestigious Barca shirt. And of course, Atletico never took that lightly. They saw it as a very big disrespect. He still has a long-term contract with the club and, you know, admiring their rivals, talk so nicely about their rivals, the same league. I mean, it was unacceptable. And of course, Jao Felix even wants to leave as Atletico themselves want him to go as well. He had a very poor loan spell at Chelsea, even though he was not that bad, but he, it was not the level that he was used to it. So as it stands, the rumor mill have kept linking Jao Felix to Barca since then. And more so, especially as the Dembele issue have come up, talking about Dembele being closely linked to Paris Saint-Germain that Jao Felix continued to be an option because there was a report earlier claiming how Barca have rekindled their interest in Jao Felix as an option to replace Usman Dembele and he's cost 50 million which I think Barca would not be able to pay 
But honestly, as I've said earlier, as I've said many times, there is no need trying to look for cash to add to Dembele's transfer fee to buy a new forward, right? We have players like Abde El Zazuli, which I definitely think he's, he's a gift that we have. And if Barca doesn't know how to, if Barca does not realize what they have, the treasure they have, then, then the, it is very unreasonable because there's no need sloshing money when they know the club is in serious financial turmoil and we're trying to even look for more cash to, to, to go, in fact, to, uh, to, 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 to follow the financial fair play. And we have players like Abde and we're talking about another replacement to come to Barca as the better replacement. It makes no sense. Because there have, a lot of, there have been a lot of reports, like even players like Carrasco has been linked since this Dembele saga started, to the extent of even Alexis Sanchez have been linked, all these stories, I still don't get it, why on earth? We to, we've not even gotten a right back yet, so I don't see any reason why they should be looking for another winger because Dembele is gone. So why can't Xavi and trust young update to do the job he has proven it already or oh, they want him to kill himself to show that he can do it i don't think so then on to the next story of discussion the potential sale of usman dembele to psg means barca have endured a very hectic schedule in the transfer market although barca are not in favor of a sale dembu's departure could free up a significant salary mass which in turn could help the club bring in new players. One such player Barca might pursue following the departure of Dembele is Bernardo Silva. The Portuguese has once again been linked with a move to Barca. You know, with Barca interested in signing him if Dembele goes on a big fee. According to Gerard Romero, Barca coach Xavi Hernandez have even contacted Bernardo in the last few hours. Xavi has informed him that Barca are working on a deal to sign him up. The player for his part is reportedly looking for a move away from the Etihad. Xavi, meanwhile, has harbored hopes of Silva. Not um, for a long time, the Portuguese international is the Barca coach's ideal choice as he looks to reinforce his options in the interior midfield slot. Silva was notably linked with a move to Camp Nou last summer. But the move did not materialize due to Barca's financial woes. Providing Barca are able to complete the deal, Bernardo Silva will not be the only Man City player moving to Barca in this summer. In fact, the playmaker will join his former teammate Ilkay Gondogan, who had joined the club on free earlier this summer. However, whether or not Barca can pull off this deal remains a big question. Even if Barca succeed in offloading Dembele on a big fee, they would still require additional infusion of cash in order to afford Bernardo Silva. The club, however, have an excellent relationship with Manchester City, so it will be interesting to see how things transpire in the coming weeks. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.